Hey guys, what's up? I'm Ola England of The Haunted, Feared, and this YouTube channel that you're watching right now. This week I'm going to Japan. Success! Yes! And I figured I would make a video and show what I have in my carry-on luggage when I go out on tour or when I go out traveling. Last time I was out traveling, I went to Barcelona. I got mugged of my carry-on luggage, so... Basically, I lost everything. Passport, computer, camera, everything. And uh, it was just a really big hassle. Fortunate for me, I was insured. So I've been able to replace almost everything. I figured I would make this video to just, you know, it's a good thing to remind yourself what I actually need when I'm out traveling. So generally, when I'm out traveling for work or for The Haunted, for instance, I try to fit everything that's not music related into my carry-on luggage so I don't have any extra luggage. My carry-on is basically everything I need for when I'm out traveling. And uh, I'm gonna make this little short video and show you what I keep in my carry-on luggage. First and foremost, the most important thing that I bring would be my hairbands. Very important. I tend to lose hairbands all the time. So I need to keep an extra pair of hairbands with me at all times. I would probably exclude everything else if I just had to pick one thing to bring with me in my carry-on case. It will be my hairbands. Okay? Makes sense. So, I got my hairbands here. They're close for me to, to grab if I need them. Huh. Huh. Okay. So, uh, another thing is my uh, MacBook Pro. This is a new one. And um, because my last one was stolen, obviously. So, on the insurance money, I managed to buy a new MacBook Pro. And... Uh, yeah, it's nice looking. Unfortunately, because it has the new USB-C ports and nothing else, you have to buy one of these as well. So you can hook up like your real stuff. So this little uh, thing that I put here on the side, it has regular USB ports. It has a memory card reader and an HDMI out. And I'm also bringing an HDMI cable so I can hook up my computer to my TV and watch movies and stuff like that when I'm out traveling. But obviously I'm working a lot when I'm out on tour, so the MacBook is very important. I can, you know, work with my music, I can work with videos, Final Cut Pro and uh, Logic Pro X. And it's a very important item for me. And uh, basically because I'm storing everything on cloud or cloud services, I can work on the same things that I'm working on at home, but on the road. So cloud services are definitely one of the greatest inventions in a long time, I would say. When my previous MacBook got stolen, I mean, I got pissed off, of course, but obviously not because of the stuff that was inside, because all that can be replaced because I'm using and I'm working through cloud services. So in that sense, the future is really here you know you don't have to worry about your stuff everything is password protected and uh yeah you can just replace the computer and you're up and running in minutes basically so the computer very important and it's small little dick or pair of balls that you put on it which is totally stupid i hate that at least it has a headphone output a regular one so thank god for that okay another thing that's very important of course extra battery uh, what do you call it? Power bank. Very important for when you're losing uh, power. <laughs> okay, let's go to the headphones. And uh, my previous headphones were also stolen in my carry-on. So I bought a pair of new ones. These are from Bose. They're noise-canceling headphones. And uh, I think they're called Quiet Comfort. Yada yada, something something. But uh, I'm I was very happy with these, so I bought uh, a pair just like the ones that got stolen because I'm just very happy. They sound great, they're small, and uh, yeah, noise cancelling too. So if I'm sharing room with uh, anyone with, in the haunted, I use these uh, when they snore a lot. And dude, the people in the haunted, god damn it, everyone snores. Holy shit. Okay. Yeah, that pisses me off, to be honest. So I'm trying to get my own room here and there, just to, you know, actually get some sleep now and then. <laughs> That's what's so good about bus tours, 
usually you cannot hear the snoring because the bus is driving so I sleep a lot better during bus tours believe it or not next thing obviously one of these so you can actually hook up your stuff in the country you're in this is just a small piece of shit thing here I have and then I have my camera which was also stolen in my carry-on luggage and I bought the same exact one this is a Panasonic Lumix GH5 and it's just a really really good camera and it's not that big either so I can do vlogging like this hey man what's up looking good there I like your beard yeah so I'm not bringing this all the time but since I'm going to Jakarta after Japan to uh, do some quality checking of solar guitars I'm bringing this with me because I like uh, you know documenting stuff a very important thing and a new thing this is my Christmas gift to myself a Nintendo Switch and uh, before I've been bringing you know controllers and trying to play games on my MacBook and it's fine you know I can play 2D games and stuff like that but it's uh, it's a hassle really so this Nintendo Switch is basically my new gaming system for going on the road and um, I play right now I'm playing Zelda Super Mario and Mario Kart those are the games that I have if I bring my dock I can hook it up to a TV or anything like that or I can actually pull off the controllers like this I can place the the screen like that and I can plug the controllers into this so it's a little easier to play and I can play games wherever I can do this on the plane and just have, use this as a screen so in that sense I think Nintendo has really nailed it with the Nintendo Switch it's not you know it's not PS4 graphics it's not supposed to be it's never been about the graphics with Nintendo but the games are really good I mean if they would ever release Witcher 3 on Nintendo Switch that would ruin my life and of course I'm carrying it in my beautiful little Nintendo Switch case and uh, what else of course I have a, a bag of cables uh, with all the chargers and you know HDMI cables so I can hook everything up to whatever TV is at the hotel and uh, yeah that's it for this then I also bring my glasses of course you never know if the sun peaks out and you need to look cool somewhere it's always good to bring a couple of Ray-Bans or something like that and then of course I bring my regular glasses because I'm blind maybe you didn't know that but yeah I'm blind so I need these sometimes yeah okay so what else yes an envelope with copies of all my tickets flight tickets hotel details passports all that passports like I'm some kind of secret agent I have a Russian passport too that's why I keep the glasses this is my Russian uh, persona this is Ola this is Vloda Ola Vloda okay good toiletry items basically I don't have that much you know I need a deodorant toothpaste and toothbrush nail clipper oh what else yeah contact lenses shit I always forget about that depending on how many days you're out I take one pair of black socks and one pair of underwear for each day so if I'm gone five days it's five pieces of underwear five pieces of black sock it has to be black socks there is no other color only black same thing with t-shirts basically yeah just black a couple of them and then I try to you know when I travel I try to put on as much clothes as possible you know I have my thick hoodie and my big uh, coat so I don't have to pack them down into the carry-on because that just takes a lot of space yeah there you have it this is what I bring with me when I go out on tour or go out traveling and uh, yeah I mean you don't really need much more I guess I guess the most important thing are the black socks now that I think of it I know. Yeah. yeah good good all right thank you so much for watching this short little stupid video if you want to see links to all this stuff check the description subscribe if you haven't already and uh, give this video a thumbs up thank you so much and see you next time